Welcome back to What Are TV Lips with General Disturbance. This is an ELC MN90, or otherwise known as a Steve 90 after Steve Wolf's. It's a, it's a tier 8 French premium light tank. It's located on the northwest spawn of Pearl River and it's under the command of Baseman from Hell. And he sent me this replay only yesterday. I'm afraid, yeah, there is a troll on this team. He's in the Wizzy 132 and his name is Dobri Vitamina 11. Now, as you can see, the ELC M90 is quite a quick little light tank and it's also very easy to hide in any bush or even a twig, as Steve proves to us uh, regularly. He's got a 90mm gun capable of uh, 220 Alpha, I think it is. Yes, 220 Alpha and penetrates 175 millimeters of armor. Now the troll, is the troll coming this way? Yes he is, there he is. And they fired on the EBR who suddenly appears and he gets the kill on the EBR. So three shots, well used. And he's now gonna head into the town, which is probably not the best place for a light tank, but I think he's gonna try and use his spotting to help his teammates, plus of course get a few shots on the enemy. He's very small to see, so it should be very easy for him to get shots on the enemy from some of these places up on top of the heights. Yes, he spotted a T-30 already. Yeah, it's just at the moment highlighting where the enemy is he keeps getting um, going up to the edge and oh here we got the troublemaker and I'm gonna come out of view because see what's going on here and he is definitely trolling baseman uh, baseman's driven up against that uh, steps and he's being pinned there by the 132 and the only reason I can think that he's doing this is because he was angry that baseman managed to get the kill on the EBR and now he's riding up on top of him he's trying to flip him and he has flipped him and now Baseman's on his side and yes Baseman's on his side and the Wizzy 132 is just sitting there and now he can't take part in the battle now the Progetto is not exactly helping and the Wizzy 132, well, he's gone up to try and do the spotting job that Baseman was doing. Except, of course, he's obviously got spotted straight away and fired at. But he wasn't hit. But he's now being a nuisance to Progetto as well. It looks like he's trying to hog that position. Meanwhile, Baseman is stuck. He can't do anything. The Wizzy 132 is pulled away. Progetto doesn't seem to know that uh, Baseman's on his side. And now Baseman's been hit. In fact, that was a hit on the Progetto from the GW Tiger on the enemy team. We can know where he is. He's actually behind the cap now. But uh, Baseman got hit by some of the splash from that shell. So, I'm sorry I'm using free camera because otherwise you wouldn't really be able to see much. From this position let's go down a bit lower he's still stuck here and it looks as if there's an enemy tank nearby but if the enemy does turn up in the town he's going to be in trouble I and mean, he's turned his gun around to actually face the enemy if they do come in from that direction but i'm not sure he'll actually be able to get a shot because he can't elevate the gun enough And he's actually saying in chat that he's actually going to send the replay to Wargaming, which is true. Yes, he and he sent it to me as well. So we'll do the video and we warn everyone that the Wizzy 132 is a troll. The Wizzy 132 has been killed now. The enemy got him. But... Um, Baseman's still basically in the game. He could take part, but for the fact, obviously, he's on his side. 
and his teammates are not really making any um, effort to right him. In fact, they're more in engaged in the battle that's going on on the southwest side of the map. If an enemy tank turns up in the town, he's going to be dead very shortly. He has asked for help, but nobody seems to be listening. This new communication system that Wargaming have brought in really isn't working. Yes, it makes a beep, but nobody's taking any notice of it. And there's not a lot the baseman can do whilst he's here. He's just got to hope and pray that he can get a shot on somebody if they appear from that direction. Because that's the direction they're going to come from. Well, as you can see, his team are losing the game. All they've got left now is the light tank, which is uh, baseman, a heavy tank. Oh, they've lost one of their arty. The heavy tank's the E75TS, and he's engaging the T30. Just lost one of the another of their arty. They're about to lose the third. The Scorpion G will see him and take him out. Uh, the bat chat's found the RT and he's trying to run away. There goes the 75 TS. There goes the M40, M43. And I expect that the enemy will probably start capping now. If they do come into the town, they'll spot him straight away and they'll just dispatch him. They won't. They'll probably fall over themselves laughing that, uh, the, en uh, that the enemy team could be so stupid as to flip one of their teammates over. And somebody's suggesting in chat the enemy might still draw. No, they won't. Not with eight minutes remaining. They will cap and they will win. They probably won't even bother to look because light tanks can hide just about anywhere. Oh, T-30's found him. And there you go. So that game was ruined by the Wizzy 132 Dobri Vitamina 11. So, let's have a look at the end of battle stats. Well, yes, I'm afraid um, the only kill in the game that um, Baseman managed to get on this occasion was the ELC, uh, the ELC, the EBR 75 FL10. He got two shots into the guy, not uh, three. I thought he got all three into the guy, but only two. But he did get the kill shot, and I think that's what angered the Wizzy 132, because the Wizzy 132 thought that that kill was his, uh, because he did hit that guy as well. And he got 251 hit points of damage. But that was about the only damage that he actually did. You can see the Wizzy 132 didn't get any spotting at all. Because of course it was Baseman. Who'd already done the spotting of those enemy tanks. And uh, in fact actually he was showing. No he actually didn't spot any enemy tanks. And neither did the Wizzy 132. So neither of them actually spotted any enemy tanks. But because they lost a light tank, they lost a gun out of the game. And that made it much easier for the enemy to win that game. And I'm afraid uh, Baseman ended up with a loss for the game. Because he was using consumables. Which means that he is out of pocket due to that Wizzy 132. 242 XP. That's all he gets out of that game. Uh, the battle, the amount for the battle and the bonus for being a premium vehicle. But it was the Wizzy 132s entirely to blame for that one. So, okay, let's have a look and see the name and see if that guy is a um, an anonymized person. We'll click on his name and see if that's his real identity. Yes, it is. Dobri Vitamina 11. And he's played 38,000 battles uh, with quite a good, fairly good racing. But this guy is a troll. And he's actually uh, not the sort of person you want on your team because he's the sort of person who's actually going to ruin your game for you. And Wargaming, you need to give this guy suspension. You need to warn him that he has to abide by the rules and the rules do not include flipping your teammates over so they can't play in the battle at all. Uh, so please give this guy a suspension, preferably a week or slightly longer. Uh, but certainly he does deserve some ban of one kind or another. Thanks for watching.